Sherry, can you use your fork? Mom Stephanie Trilling says she tries hard to keep her four year old daughter away from juice, mostly because of its sugar content. It's not something I want to give to my kids, but I also don't want to be that mom who is restricting everything. But she may have another reason to restrict juice intake a new analysis from Consumer Reports. James Dickerson is chief scientific officer. His team tested 45 different juices for four heavy metal substances inorganic arsenic, lead, cadmium, and mercury. They found that every single product contained a measurable amount of at least one heavy metal except for mercury. 21 of the samples contained one or a combination of heavy metals that reached a level consumer. Consumer Reports researchers deemed concerning for daily consumption. The CDC says long term exposure to heavy metals may put people at risk for kidney disease, diabetes, high blood pressure, damaged ability to learn, and certain types of cancer. Consumer Reports is recommending parents lower the amount of juice they give their kids. So they should be concerned, but don't panic. Frequent exposure to these heavy metals through the juice is the concern. The Juice Products Association, whose board of directors includes executives from PepsiCo, Welch's, and other juice brands whose products were tested, said they haven't seen the full study, but called the results unfounded and told us they're committed to providing safe and nutritious products that meet FDA standards. They also said there is no scientific evidence indicating that trace levels of heavy metals have caused any negative health outcomes. But Dr. Leo Trasande, director of environmental pediatrics at NYU's School of Medicine says the science is telling us increasingly that there are particular time points in life where even a small amount of exposure can disrupt hormones and thereby contribute to disease. In 2013, the FDA proposed limiting inorganic arsenic and apple juice, but no change was ever made. The FDA had no comment. Consumer Reports says their findings are a spot check and should not be used to draw definitive conclusions about specific brands. Now, we reached out to all of the juice companies. Ten responded saying their products are safe and follow all food safety guidelines. Anna Werner, CBS News, New York. Consumer Reports says the metals found in seven of the 21 samples had the potential to harm children who drink only a half a cup per day. That is a 